Hello lovely people, welcome back to my channel. I am Japneet and you are watching My Peacock Art. So before we begin today's painting, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell so that every time I upload my art video, you get the notification. So today we are going to paint some beautiful autumn colors, forest trees with washes. So let's begin with today's painting. I am using A4 size watercolor sheet and I will be using washes. To start with I am using my mop brush to wet the surface. For the base layer, I am using primary cyan. I am using primary cyan as this is my sky. So we are painting as if we are looking from the bottom of the trees. We'll see all the trees merge up at the top. Here I'm using burnt umber for the ground. The difference between gouaches and watercolors is just that the gouaches are more thicker and opaque than watercolors, but their application is just the same. We are just preparing our base for the painting and I am mixing vermilion with burnt umber and lemon yellow for the highlights. I'm making the sky more darker and this blur color is just the background of the trees and now I'm using primary yellow to just give the effect of the leaves I'm just marking the area where my leaves will fall and we don't have to hurry up for making the trees we are using the lighter colors first because if we used the darker ones at this stage then we won't be able to get the fresh primary color above it. The application of gouaches is same as that of the watercolors. You can see the surface of the paper is wet and I am just using my mop brush to place the color at the spot and the color spreads on its own. You can see we are using beautiful autumn colors. Yellow, orange, yellow ochre. Here I'm mixing burnt umber with a little bit of black. I'm preparing this color for the trunk of the trees. After the drawing of the base layer, this is how it looks and I'm starting with the trees the trees at the bottom will appear broader and as they go up they will appear thinner and lighter 
will be forming a complete circle of trees here a beautiful canopy we don't have to hurry in making these trees just take your time i'm using the tip of my round brush to make these thinner branches although this is a very easy painting but you need to be patient in this painting Now I'm going over it again to get the darker areas. Some more branches here and there. I'm using mop brush to wet the surface again. And for the trees that are far away will have lighter tone and will be thinner so i'm using a rigger brush to draw those trees now i'm starting with the leaves of the trees and i'm using primary yellow i'm using my flat brush dry flat brush just took the color at the tip of the brush and dabbing it on the sheet i'll be mixing this primary yellow with vermilion because we need to get the autumn leaves and the autumn colors have yellow vermilion and yellow ochre colors I'm using vermilion at the base of the trees just to give it the look of fallen leaves yellow color is just used for the highlight The top of the trees which is hit by the sunlight will have the lighter tone so I'm using primary yellow for all the top of the trees. The leaves which are at the bottom will have the darker tone. So here we get the beautiful forest look in our painting so would you like to try it yourself this is a easy painting all you need to do is just start and you will explore your inner artist for the more exclusive painting collection you can follow me on facebook and instagram i have mentioned the links in the description also let me know what else do you want to learn in the future videos so that i can come up with the tutorials that you want So here is the painting of the day. We have beautiful autumn painting. This is how it looks like.
suggestions for me you can mention in the comments below and i'll get back to you next time with something new and interesting